The intuitives have got a variable filter feature on them which allows you to get uh, a stable reading on the display for an input which might be varying. Uh, for example, if you have a weighing system and there's vibration in the mechanics of that weighing system, uh, without filtering the display might jitter up and down. Um, by increasing the filtering value you can average the reading over a period of time which will give you a more stable response. In order to get into the filtering uh, variable you need to make sure that the meter is unlocked. So at the back of the meter we have a calibration lock switch. Make sure that's switched off and you can get into the filter variable by pressing the middle two buttons on the front panel for about three seconds and the display comes up filter and we've got the time constant of the filter in seconds here and we can increase or decrease this value using the up and down buttons. A bigger value here will give more filtering so we'll give you a more stable display but will give you a slower response so if you want fast response you need to reduce your filter time constant but if you want a more stable display you need to increase your filter time constant. So you'll need to find a compromise where the display is smooth enough for your application but has fast enough uh, response time. Once you've chosen a setting, and you can, you can try various um, uh, filter time constants in your application and just choose the one that gives you the best performance. Once you've chosen one that suits, press OK and we'll then go on to some other variables here. Just keep pressing OK until you come back to the live reading and that's your filter time constant set.